Okay. So this article is basically about people that poo in public. The B-side word. What? Right. I don't know if you guys have <laughs> seen. I don't know. Is if this you... trending? This is trending. Lol. This is trending. <laughs> is the article trending no, or people, people pooing people pooing trending? in public and getting caught. I don't know whether this has been happening and because of the technology era, we're catching it more or people are just started pooing think, in public. Do you think it's been a thing forever and now just because there's so much, so many cameras out there, they're getting caught? Possibly. It's either that. Yeah. We'll get into it. Right. All right let's go. So. I, this particular article is about a 60-year-old reti- is going to be retiring soon, 60-year-old English teacher f- who was fined for pooing in a park repeatedly, okay? So he's from Wisconsin and he actually, um, he confirmed, what's the word? He <laughs> agreed, what's the word <laughs> I'm looking for? He confirmed that several times a day, He'd been pooing in the Natureland Park in Whitewater um, for the past year, right? And someone caught him one day and told the security guards about him. They actually saw it on CCTV and got his um, registration plate. And the next time he drove in, he was stopped by security. And they said, you know, I've been stopped. Or the guy said, why are you stopping me type thing? And he goes, um... And he went to get out some evidence. He goes, you want to know why we've stopped you? And then the guy hung his head in shame and was like, for using the bathroom, <laughs> right? Which he wasn't <laughs> using the bathroom. Um, but basically his reasoning was he he did it for the convenience, but also to be disrespectful, right? Now he's ashamed of what he's done. He's like, I'm an English teacher. I, I you know, supposed to, I'm, you know, supposed to be promoting, um, active citizenship and stuff in my classes or I have that platform too and this is what I'm doing but there has been I have literally a few weeks back I was watching quite a few of them of people pooing what do you mean in public a few weeks ago you've been watching I saw another article wait wait, wait, for how long how long were you watching people (laughs) poo in the like how many videos did you watch what one wasn't enough I probably saw like maybe four what in a row wait 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 Right, I'll tell you why. I'll tell you why. It was actually all on one article, <laughs> and I watched the whole justify. lot. There's nothing you'll say would justify. I watched you watch the whole lot. So there was an article. I can't remember which um, news site it was on, and then it had like a you know a t- not a timeline. They put them all together, a collection of poo videos. So I was watching it, um, but so <laughs> and there was a, re- a really recent big one in Australia. Yeah. Do you remember Jackie O? No. Big what do you poo? mean? She did it as well. No, no. Someone thought it was her. <gasps> but it was someone that looked like her. Okay, there was a blonde. Yes, I've seen yeah, that yeah, as yeah. well. There was a blonde uh, jogger lady <laughs> yeah. who was caught um, on CCTV between two cars. Yeah. Like she pulled down her joggers or whatever. Yeah. Went poo-poo. <laughs> pulled him up, went, whatever. She got caught. But no, there was the guy. He was actually an office execu- executive. I haven't heard this. Um, and he was he he actually admitted to pooing thirty eight times in public, but he'd been pooing on people's like <laughs> like gardens, <laughs> I think, and like pathways. Is it stuff. because you, is it because they want to get caught? Is there the like that? Well, adrenaline on the doctor's show. They were saying the doctor show. Yeah, you know the doctors. It's like Doctor Oz, but it's called the doctors. Okay. Um, they were talking about this particular type of you know public pooers and they were saying um, the (laughs) the pps um they're saying that maybe this day and age we produce more narcissists and narcissists what's narcissist you're a narcissistic person if you you, you put yourself first like everything is about you i thought you put the the there's a lot of things that go into you put the word in the definition i did um (laughs) But narcissistics, OCD, like those yeah, yeah, types yeah. of people are, are prone to, to doing this. OCD? Yeah, like if they don't want to go at home. And someone with OCD poos in public. Or, yeah, if they don't <laughs> want to use the public bathroom, for instance, they might just go in the trees. Because you know that's I mean? better yeah. for someone with OCD? Less, there's less of other people's germs. Anyway. Um, oh, okay. That kind of makes sense. Yeah. Um, 
<clears throat> they were saying perhaps that's why. Um, but, I mean, some of these cases, I watched a video of this lady. She went into a, a cafe and she orders. <laughs> she went to, there's a video that you can watch it. She went to order something and for some reason they wouldn't let her, they said no to something, whatever she was asking. So she, this is all on t CCTV. She pulls down her pants, takes a dump, picks it up and throws it at the, person oh. behind the cashier she's one no. she's next level she's yeah. a poo thrower what? yeah she threw her poo at the person right she's a public poo yeah thrower. She, and this is like <laughs> imagine you walk into like gloria jeans or somewhere it's like yeah. that type of place yeah so yeah and then there was another one at S oh, southern God. illinois university where um someone was smearing poo or going for a poo inside the washing machines like the laundry facilities at the uni <laughs> <laughs> like what is going on it's not funny it's not it's funny, not funny it's not but funny. It's, <laughs> it's, it's, it's hilarious right right so i have a few what happens when you wash a poo what comes out is this still a oh. poo left? Can you wash the dirty part oh. away? Does it wash away? It, it does away. because I've washed my kids' number threes. <laughs> so, like, I rinse it off first, mind you. So, I have two stories. I have two stories. Well, not really two stories. I have, yeah, I have two stories. Go so, ahead. there's this thing when we're going to um, college, right? I don't know who did it, but this college is massive. There's a, there's this thing called um, the reverse kanga, and then there's called the double decker. Right, I think it's called the double decker. So the reverse kanga, kanga is that you you sh you poo the wrong way. You what? face the uh, cistern, <laughs> and then you poo. So you know you usually you know, so you so you so squat that, the see other that way lip? <laughs> yeah. So you poo so that the poo hits the front part of the the toilet, so it slides uh... down the front. Right. This is. I think that's a reverse kanga. I'm not sure. Anyways, and or you poo on the. F Anyways, you you you're shitting the wrong way. The second one, the double decker, you take the lid off the cistern and you poo into the, <gasps> you poo into the cistern. I don't know who, who invented this stuff, but this <laughs> when, <laughs> when the person flushes, all you see is poo coming out. <laughs> <laughs> That's awful. Wait, awful. why? It's not don't funny. tell me you did it's this. Not <laughs> it's not funny. Did you do, Why did you do know this? this Where did you hear this? This is in college because you, you hear this? rumors, right? You, you, like it, yeah, it goes man. through pretty quick. It goes, someone did a double decker. I go, <gasps> What's a double decker? <laughs> what the hell's a double decker? Right? Or top deck. I don't know what it's called. Anyways, and they said, it's when you poo in the thing and, and someone flushed it and poo came out of it and you're like, oh, yeah. Who does that though? A lot of bored 16 to 20 year olds. <laughs> <laughs> men, men, not women, men, men. That is bizarre. Man. Well, the executive that was caught That's was why <laughs> boys' toilets are yeah. just no go in public yeah. spaces. Oh, but honestly, <laughs> women's are no better. Honestly, They're actually. <coughs> do you do worse. double deckers? <coughs> do you have any double decker suspects? Oh, uh, I won't even. I'm not going to give <laughs> details on what happens. A, in woman, a woman doing a double decker. I don't even know if it's called a double decker. I don't know. But like, yeah. If if that double decker, deck. if it's top called that, top if you're in a public, if you're in a if you're in a public toilet and like you went and you flushed and like that came out, would you concern yourself with it or would you just walk off? Like, would I'm you, you try out. and be like, what? <laughs> I'm walking out. I'm walking out. There's no way. <laughs> Where did this come from? <laughs> Take it all apart. Put some rubber gloves on. <laughs> yeah, but what happens then if there's a line of people DNA test waiting to come in and that's like you? They're gonna think that you've done that. What? If there's someone, yeah. you know, there's well, a line the of people. Because the toilet's gonna be filled up with like diarrhea, basically, isn't it? And they're gonna think that you've done that. <laughs> you keep flushing. So you try again. You oh. flush again, or you're like, it's gonna get worse. I think that's I'm what I'm saying. Like, what, what would be Especially, your move? If what I haven't you heard do? of a top, a top decker, whatever it's called, I'd be like, I don't know what's going to happen if I keep flushing this. Is this just like uh, part of the system? What's going on here? I guess I'd use the like sweep it under the rug analogy. I just put a layer of toilet paper over the top, so it looks <laughs> it looks clean. Yeah? <laughs> it looks clean. <laughs> Clever. There we go. That's why you're the boss. By, by the time you by the time you've walked out the cubicle, and the next person's walked in, it's just started to soak up, and it's just like brown uh, toilet. Yeah. Brown, soggy yeah. toilet paper. They, they forgot your face by then. Yeah. They forgot, you know how bad people don't recognize That's your right. faces. We've been through this. They forgot who you are by then. G Rose, G Rose. So, but I think that the executive that got caught, the, uh, the way that he got caught. <laughs> with his pants down? Literally. So he was caught facing the camera, looking into the camera <laughs> lens with his pants down. Look, have you guys seen this? Oh. 
<laughs> and he's got toilet roll in his where hand. Does, where does that saying come in from? Caught with your pants down and someone pooing in public. He's, he's got the toilet roll in hand, <laughs> and it looks like it's outside someone's house, <laughs> literally on their pathway. I think. So I don't know what's wrong with people. I think also they think that uh, there's a thrill. There's a disorder. I forgot what they've called it. A disorder um, where you get a thrill out of, um, you know, because it's so like, ah, mm. I could get caught. I mean, this, uh, to me, every now and again, something comes out where you're like, we, we really are just being punished for being natural beings. Because like pooping <laughs> yeah. in public is extremely uh. normal. Well, not outside someone's house on not, their pathway or in no, their no, front when, garden. Okay, no, no, no. I'm not saying normal <laughs> in society. I mean, just oh. as an animal on the planet, pooping in public yeah. is a completely normal thing to do. But oh, because we a, have a society, a animal, we've gone, yeah. no, 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 no. Do this completely unnatural thing and go and poop in this bowl over there. <laughs> wow. That's, well, I was going to make the same point, but I think it's different when you, when we started talking about pooping inside, like, a building and picking it up and throwing it and then <laughs> pooping in the top of toilets. Yeah, that, I had the same that way goes, at the beginning. When he said somewhere. he went to some park and pooed, I was like, that's good for the soil. That's better than pooing in the toilet. That's better for the environment. But then throwing oh. it at an employee, to me, I mean, there might be some animals that do that, but I think that's taking it too far. <laughs> yeah. I've seen I think you can't say, this is my natural right. And then chuck poo at someone. Actually, <laughs> then you're like, Whoa. actually, monkeys do that a lot. <laughs> that's what I'm saying I know there are some animals that do that and I would also try and punch a monkey in the face <laughs> uh, there was another one final one this woman was walking into like Walmart or something and mid stride a poo falls out <laughs> and it was caught on CCTV but she, mid stride yeah, but she didn't flinch she didn't flinch but get this the guy behind her stepped in it <laughs> <laughs> that's impressive oh <laughs> That is that's impressive. <laughs> Actually, oh, just thinking no. about it, running, mid talking about mid stride, pooping in public is a really normal thing for runners, like uh, like ultra marathon yeah. runners, marathon runners. That's a normal thing. Yeah, yeah because the gut, the running True. does something to their gut thing. It makes them need to poo. I read that too. <laughs> <laughs> she she dropped the mid stride. Miss, you dropped something. Do you want to watch the video, the Miss, clip? Miss, you dropped something. Never mind. I've got I it on my shoes. My sister no, had a thing for watching people poo. I know. <laughs> 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 You're going to be so excited to watch a clip. Weird habits. It's What's it called? part of yeah. my research, What's that show about guys. Weird habits? What's that? Um, women? My strange addiction. My strange addiction. It's not just women, guys. It seems to be. Again, it was part of my research. <laughs> it's finished now. You can stop watching. You, it's it's not the fact that you've seen it. It's how excited you are to get Dev to watch it with you. <laughs> I want you guys to watch it <laughs> yeah, so you can be like, like, like You've told me the story. We got, we're on a podcast. We now know enough to talk about. But you're like, nah, let's watch it as well. <laughs> Does that add anything other than what, what, why are we watching this? Because I want to see your guys' shock, shock reaction. Oh, shock! You shocked me already. I've been shocked. I'm shocked enough. The listeners can't see it at home. It adds no value. Let's just be shocked and move okay, on. Okay, that's true. <laughs>